Let's compare the fraction 7 eighths to 9 tenths. So we want to know which is bigger, 7 over 8 or 9 over 10. There are two ways we could do this. First, we could find a common denominator. So if we could find a number that's the same on the bottom of these fractions, then we just compare the numerators. Whichever numerator is larger, that's the larger fraction. So let's do that first. So I could list all the multiples of 8 and 10, but I think I'm just going to take 8 times 10, because I know that'll be 80, and then 10 times 8, that'll give me 80 as well. So now I have the same denominator. But I can't just multiply by 10. I have to multiply the top and the bottom by 10. That's because 10 over 10, that's equal to 1. So I'm just multiplying 7 eighths by 1. I get 7 times 10 is 70. 8 times 10 is 80. But 7 over 8 and 70 over 80, they're the same actual number. So that's good. Down here, I need to multiply by 8 over 8. So 9 times 8 is 72, and then I have 80 down here. So now I can compare these. They have the same denominator, and I'm going to compare the numerator. 72, that's larger than 70. So 9 tenths is larger than 7 eighths. We could also convert these to fractions. 70 divided by 80, that gives us 0 0.875. 72 divided by 80, that's 0 0.9. And if it helps, you can write 0 0.900, compare these two. 0 0.9 is larger than 0 0.875, so 9 tenths is larger than 7 eighths. This is Dr. B comparing 7 eighths to 9 tenths. Thanks for watching.